Hi, I'm Dr. Rachel Tatman with Kaggle, and today I'm going to show you how to update a Kaggle dataset. So I have here a fake data set. Um, you can see the usability rating isn't great. I could probably spend a little bit of time uh, improving it, but again, it is fake, so probably not going to invest that time. Uh, and I'm going to upload a new version. So I've gotten a uh, different file right here uh, that is uh, data that has been generated. This is all fake data um, that I want to replace my current data in my data set with. But I don't want to delete my data set because anyone who's written kernels on it, those kernels might disappear uh, or they might not be able to continue working on it. So I am instead going to update my data set. Uh, and I will do that by first clicking over here on the, uh, we'll call it the meatball menu, these three dots next to new notebook, uh, and then new version. And this will enter a new modal, uh, so a little, little pop-up window. Uh, and I, here I want to enter the reason why I'm updating the data set. So new version of file. Uh, here I'm going to upload a file, and you can't see this, but this has opened um, a file browser on my computer. Uh, and I have in that browser this uh, data file mock data updated, so the same as this one, and I have uh uh, uploaded this one and I also want to get rid of this file so I could if I wanted to create a data set right now and it would have two files in it but I want to replace this mock data one file with this mock data updated file so I'm going to remove this data set from the uh, this file from the data set by clicking the red X and then hit create uh, and this will take a little bit to create a new version and it's done it actually didn't take that long at all uh, and I can close that and then when I look at the activity tab, you can see that I have uh, version one, so the original version of this data set that was created about a year ago, and then version two, the new version of this data set that has um, different data in the file. And if we look at the, the file, we can see that it's mock data updated, so the new file that I uploaded, uh, and that the old file that was in the data set has disappeared. So that's all you need to do to update a data set on Kaggle. You can also do it via the API, and the documentation for that is on the, um, the GitHub page for the Kaggle official API. All right, thanks so much. I hope you uh, find this useful and update some of your data sets, and I will see you on Kaggle. Bye.